Having a big head saved my life. When I was 14, I wanted to buy a fedora, but none of them fit me. That is a blessing in disguise, my friend. That is a blessing in disguise. Although I must come clean, uh, for, for about two months, when I was 14, 15, something like that, I, uh, I owned a fedora. Um, I was starting to mutate into one of them. But I saw the light and uh, burnt it cere ceremonially. Yeah, that's a word. Anyway. Yes, this is r slash just neckbeard things, a collection of sweaty, body odor heavy, neckbeard wearing gentlemen. Or at least that's what they like to think they are but they're actually just assholes. So let's have a look at some, uh, some examples of this. I was adjusting my hat when a girl walked by and she thought I was tipping it to her. I want to kill myself, milady. That's, that's unfortunate. Um, I think most people can, uh, can relate to this, uh, at least in some aspect, I suppose. It's dreadful, I just had a thought, oh my God. I know I do this and I know a lot of other people do this, is, is you'll be having a conversation with someone or someone will say something along the lines of, oh my God, Jared, such a, Jack, he fucked me and then he fucked my best friend Janine and then he fucked that fat bitch Lisa or something. Oh, all men are assholes. And then, and then I have to resist the urge so desperately to go, but all men aren't like that. But eventually I, I, I suppress it and I realise that that just makes me sound like a, a douchebag <laughs> and indeed a neckbeard. The 30 year old guy who won't leave his parents house is now on Infowars. Now, of course, Alex Jones looks like that because, number one, he's Alex Jones, and number two, even he's confused about, uh, about why this chap is still living with his mum. He's got a bit of a, a, bit of a Jesus vibe going on. He, he, he could well be, you know, neckbeard uh, neck Jesus with the hair and the, the beard and the aura that he thinks he's, uh, he's the best person since sliced bread. The best thing since sliced bread, rather. Although the, the looks uh, are where the similarities end between him and Jesus. He didn't have any kind of noble cause, he just doesn't want to move out of his parents' house and uh, the only thing he's sacrificing is personal space, I guess. He's getting his fucking washing done for him. Free rent. Food. Fucking arsehole. Anyway, when people complain about being in the friend zone, this is what they actually mean. I am a good person and I demand that you take my penis. Oh dear. It's true though, it's like, why don't you just, why don't you just be friends with someone? Someone doesn't want to fuck you. And move on, it's okay, don't worry. You'll find someone eventually. Maybe not. If you keep uh, keep acting like this, maybe not. Oh, fuck's sake. <laughs> okay, so apparently this gaming shop is, uh, has had to put a sign up. So it's, it's, it's like one of those shops that you go in and you play board games. I don't know. I've only ever seen them and heard of them. I've, I've never stepped foot in the place because I've seen the people stepping in to the place and I don't really want to be... Uh, I don't want to be associated with that kind of person. We are sorry to have to say this, but unfortunately people's personal hygiene is starting to degrade. For the benefit of all, please bathe yourselves <laughs> and wash your clothes because no one wants to have an embarrassing conversation about body odour, which results in you being asked to leave and not come back until you are. Clean up. Please think about yourself and others. We all have to share this gaming space and it's not nice for others to have to put up with your lack of personal hygiene, you filthy filthy bastard. Thank you for taking the time to read this and we hope you enjoy your time here, the staff of Harlequins. That's fucking disgusting, dude. How did it get to a point where you, you don't have to just say it to one person or maybe two people that, you know, you're a bit whiffy, maybe you should take a shower once a week or something, but you have to put a fucking sign up that is laminated, by the way. Hi there, I'm Fedora and your profile rather intrigues me. I think you look rather scrumptious. <laughs> <clears throat> Would you be interested in drinks with a gentleman, milady? Nope. That's a hard no on that one. Well, fuck you then. <laughs> Why is it always the classic zero to a hundred? Like, hello, I, I, I like you very much and I think you're very scrumptious. And would you mind? Would you like, oh, isn't it? Wouldn't it be cute? Mm. Uh, and then it immediately goes to, well, fuck you. You're a fat bitch and I hate you. And I, I don't, I didn't want to go without you, out with you. <clears throat> Can't speak today. I didn't want to go out with you anyway. And, and, uh, and uh, you're an asshole in one, like, word. And that word is no. Oh, dear me. I'm getting irate now. So the caption of this one, of course, is, um, they understand me in Japan. Although by the look on this chap's face, I don't think they'll understand you in Japan. Um, I don't know if any peoples around the world will understand you. Uh, I, I, think, I think it's a you thing rather than an anyone else thing. Let's be perfectly honest. That pink hair, though, is pretty, um, 
majestic. I'm slightly confused as well, to be fair. I, I don't know if he, he's he's trying to look like his waifu or if he is his own waifu. That would be that would make sense actually, because his right hand would be him. Um, yep, moving on. Penguin eats all the fish, gets fat and refuses to walk, mate and communicates. But in its mind, um, it's not his own fault for not wanting to mate. He probably really does want to mate, but he wants it to be given to him on a plate. It is very cute though. If you took the fedora off, it'd be really, it'd be really sweet. The Venn diagram of dudes lining up for Szechuan sauce and dudes who make fun of girls lining up for uni <laughs> lining up for unicorn frappuccinos is a circle. To be fair, I didn't try either of them, but uh, I'd probably prefer a unicorn frappuccino because it looked pretty sweet, literally and figuratively. Oh god, my jokes today are shit. I do apologise for that. <laughs> I'm very tired. All these breakup songs are so gay. How about you realise that there is no love, but just your confusing hormonal urge to reproduce? Man, did I show those guys. <laughs> I love that picture so much, it's great. Although I just realised the guy who's uh, taking the piss out of fucking uh, Nice Guy 2.0 has a picture of a chihuahua with a cigarette on. I like it, that's pretty good. Sonic says if your profile picture is from an anime, your opinion doesn't count. Yeah, I mean, in general, I know people who, who have anime profile pictures, and they're all right. They're nice people. I think they're just misguided. I think this should be a PSA is, um, if you don't want to be this guy, take the take the anime profile picture off, and then the people who still leave it on, uh, then then you can avoid them. I think that'd be a good, uh, pretty good metric in, uh, in who to avoid on the internet. My mom took away my body pillow and I'm running out of pus bottles, but at least I spoiled Star Wars. <laughs> For someone, some for some poor bastard on the forum. Oh, I got him! I got him! I've never seen Star Wars. I'm sorry. I really am. So actually, this guy could spoil it for me. He could genuinely spoil the uh, the one that came out in the 70s for me, and I I wouldn't know, to be fair. And that will do it for r slash just neckbeard things. A little bit shorter this time, um, but again, I'm tired and I'm making no sense in my own head, let alone what I'm saying out loud to a microphone. Anyway, thank you very much for watching. If you like the video, do smash the absolute bollocks out of the button. What you can do this time is you can nail some uh, some rusty nails into a um, baseball bat. Then get that bat and, and practice swinging because it's going to have a different weight to it, okay? Aim it at the like button and smash it with it on your screen so liquid crystals like pissing out of your monitor um, and you'll have to buy another one. But um, it'd be fun, I guess. Alternatively, just, just push it with the mouse and click click on the button. Do subscribe if you want, because um, why the fuck wouldn't you? I do have a Twitter, at UnamusedBrit, and I have an Instagram, which is um, something, link below. I post pictures of um, like neoprene glove penises and keyboards. It's it's pretty fabulous. And of course, I will leave a link in the description below to r slash justneckbeardthings. And thank you very much for watching again. Bye for now.